Hello and thanks for joining us. This is news on the go. In today's bulletin, the Electoral Commission has threatened to cancel the registration of some 17 political parties for failing to establish national and regional offices across the country. Now, in a statement dated October 13, 2022, the Commission revealed that this contravenes Section 15, Subsection 1 of the Political Parties Act 2000, Act 574. The 17 parties have until Thursday, October 20th, 2022, to justify why their registrations should not be terminated. The affected parties include the United Progressive Party, led by Akwesi Ade, popularly known as Odike. Another one on the list is the United Front Party, which has been led currently by Nana Ajenim Boateng, popularly known as Jataba, following this agreement with Odike. The Democratic Freedom Party, formed by Dr. Obediao Asamoa, the National Reform Party led by Gozi Tano, the Reform Patriotic Democrats, and a host of others, all are on the list. The rest are Democratic People's Party, United Development System Party, Every Ghanaian Living Everywhere, Yes People's Party, United Ghana Movement, New Vision Party, Ghana Democratic Republic Party and the Ghana National Party. The others also include the Power United Party, People's Action Party, United Renaissance Party and the United Love Party. The Independent Ghana will monitor this story to keep you updated. My name is Abigail Chumwa Ampofo. Subscribe to this channel and visit theindependentghana.com for more news.